Hello, darlings. I am Cassandra. Welcome to the Daily Inspirational Oracle Reading. I'd like for you to take a moment to think about anything that is troubling you, any problems you may have, any concerns. If you are looking for a sign from the universe, this may be the sign for you. Or you may simply allow your mind to settle within your heart and let whatever issues surface from your subconscious mind and resonate with this reading. The first card I have for you today is from Jungle Beauty Goddess Katara. And Jungle Beauty Goddess Katara's message for you today is safety first. She represents our root chakra. The second card I have for you is from Jungle Beauty Goddess Kalahari. I mean, I'm sorry, Afar. And Jungle Beauty Goddess Afar's message to you, darling, is be innovative. Turn your idea upside down. And the last card I have for you for this inspirational reading energy check-in it's from Jungle Beauty Goddess Kalahari. And Jungle Beauty Goddess Kalahari's message for you today is... Get our focus here. Okay, we're just going to keep moving. Sometimes love means letting go. So I'm going to give you my collective intuition about this hand. What my spirit is telling me is whatever is working for you in your life, that is what you need to focus on, darling. Going faster, harder, you know, uh, putting more energy into the wrong direction is still not going to get you where you are trying to go. So Spirit is asking you to take a moment to look at your life and be grateful for what you have, but to also look at your life and do an inventory of what is working because you are at a point in your life with that wherever you whatever you focus on is what you're going to get the most of whatever you focus on is going to amplify it's going to to magnify it's going to multiply you understand so make sure that whatever you wherever and whatever you are focusing on is what you really really want so um the card we have from jungle beauty goddess uh, afar which is telling you be innovative and turn your idea upside down this card is pretty much saying what you're doing is not working and you need to come up with a strategy you need to come up with a plan you need to come up with something logical and you need to figure out how to make it work so let's just say for example you are trying to go back to school I'm just giving you a quick example and for some reason nobody no school is accepting you at this time but yet you have a business that you have quite a few clients you have to turn clients away because you're getting all these clients but you're focused on your degree which isn't really working are for you I think the universe is saying at this point look at those clients that you are turning away look at what's working in your life and put your attention there so um, and so turning your idea upside down it doesn't mean no it just means re-strategize you know how when you have Siri and you make a mistake and you make a wrong turn and then she has to recalculate your route Spirit is asking you to recalculate your route. And also, um, the card here from Jungle Beauty Goddess Kalahari that is saying to uh, sometimes love means letting go. Darling, sometimes we can love something, but it doesn't necessarily, it's not prospering us. It is not making us better. If you are in a relationship with someone and you are looking to have children and you are looking for that relationship to grow, and you want a long-term committed relationship with this person but you're still not even sure about your status spirit is saying this you know to is it prospering is it growing your safety first means looking out for your physical mental emotional well-being right you're not going to take your hard or earned money and throw it into um a job or i'm going to say a some type of business endeavor that is really not showing any type of return and you've been doing it for a very long time you're not going to risk what you already have to go after what you want and that's what a, a mistake a lot of people make it's like what you have is never enough it's never good enough and so you spend all of your time and your resources chasing you know something that you don't have and you look around and you've lost that mate you've 
you lost the job that you have. You have, you've lost your friends. You know what I'm saying? You lost your health because everything that you already have, you've been taking it for granted. So, my intuition for this reading, for this oracle, and for daily oracle inspirational reading dialogue is for you to take stock of what you have do not lose what you have in pursuit of what you want make sure that what you are chasing is something you want to amplify multiply in your life and that you should take the plan that you have re-strategize reorganize and make sh and to come up with a logical plan i think what the message i'm getting is this is not a time for you to be frivolous and for you to um, keep going after something where there are no returns. Rather, it's like I said, if it's a relationship, if it's a job, if it's a, a business idea, there, Spirit is saying focus on something that you really truly love that you would like to see grow. But make sure you take care of home first. Make sure you take care of your health first. Make sure you look at what is working in your life. Be grateful for it. And pay attention to it, child. Because what you pay attention to at this juncture in your life, it is going to multiply. So that is the message I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching. And I look forward to seeing you, darling, in the next video.